Hello. Welcome back to Resident Evil 5. So, last part, we uh, started the game. Um, kicked a load of arse. We fought an Uroboros. Oh, I hate these things. Oh, wait. No, oh, never mind. God, I hate these things so much. Uh, yeah, as I was saying, um, yeah, we started the game, fought Uroboros for the first time, then uh, loads of dogs, killed a guy in a truck, so we were supposed to meet Irving, we turned up to the meet point, and everybody was dead. <coughs> so now we are hunting down Irving, trying to find out what the fuck is going on. Okay. Noted. Can't actually break them in this game with knives. Righto. So, yeah, we are trying to find Irving, to find out what the hell's going on. Um, shooting the local populace while we go along as well. Because they are all infected Someone's with here. Las Plagas. I'll not get it in a bit. Was just thinking, uh, yeah, I get get a sniper rifle real soon. You grab it. Okay. But it's basically after I need it. <laughs> Pretty much. Take it, Roger. Let's give Sheva some ammo because she's going to be needing it. Uh, I'm not looking for BSA emblems, because I have done everything in this game that there is to do. Pretty sure there's money in the war. But yeah, I've finished the game on every difficulty, except amateur actually. Because I platinumed the game and then didn't need to play it anymore. Uh, the only thing I haven't done is get all of the trophies for the DLCs, so I haven't got all of the versus mode trophies, uh, because nobody plays it and anyone that does play it is a fucking sweat or has Bangladeshi dial up so that's just lagging all over the place uh, yes yeah, so I don't have them I also haven't actually done the DLCs on professional I think that's what I've got left to do Which I'm going to do off camera, because professional in this game is actually quite rough. Especially in DLCs. Because uh, I don't think you actually get to use upgraded guns. Yeah we are. Bring it on. Smack him. Or don't. Right, missed my window. Oh, nice! <laughs> Did he just call me sassy? <laughs> no need for that. What are you talking about? Alright, uh, okay, we're kind of clear. There is a lot more enemies here, though. Lot more. I'm trying to think of what comes next after this bit. Uh, there. Oof. I think the next location is fucking hell, knees of steel. Is uh, the the swamp. I'm going to take the shotgun ammo, shall I? You don't have the shotgun. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. Uh, no, it's the... Cliffs. Yeah. The cliffs, uh, then the caves, and then we're in the tribal area. Which is actually fucking well hard. That's the hardest part of the game. Fuck's sake. Fuck off. I 
he thinks he Shiver has just got the dead man's click. Let's try and find her some ammo, shall we? Do you? Good enough. Right, uh, oh yeah, and on every level we've done so far, we have got on an S rank. Not going to go in the water. There's treasures in there, but uh, can't be asked. Those crossbow bastards! What a fucking shot that was. Better now. Cared. I've actually forgotten what the helicopter guy's name is in Rizzy 4. I forgot that like 10 seconds after he died. Um, his name wasn't Kirk, was it? Oh shit. <laughs> nice try, fuck nuts. There is a treasure in the middle of the market, but uh, you have to use a grenade. We'll get the uh, big bald guy to smash him up. But the big bald guy's dead, and I don't want to use my grenade. Uh, I do that. Okay, I do have an inventory space left. Good. Because I am about to get the sniper rifle. Kirk, do, do, do your, do your thing, do your thing, ow. Are you okay? Um, Kirk? Hello? Oh, fucking help. Now he fucking does it. One sniper rifle. Oh yeah. He's, uh, he's not in any rush to fucking help me out, is he? Ah oh, shit. I just shot the door. Stampy Stampy. Bosh. Right. Let's try and organise our inventory a little bit, shall we? I want to keep them. Uh, let's give that to... Sheva. She can give me them. And she can give me Thanks, bruh. Can't be frosty. It's Africa. It's very fucking warm here. <laughs> Silly man. I'm also going to turn my TV down because my headphones are deafening. That'll do. Right. Uh, there is a fair amount of goodies here, I believe. And enemies. Sorry, mate. Not really. Whoa. She's wasting her SMG. Oh, she doesn't have any handgun ammo. Okay, that kind of makes sense. Blah. Oof. A maggot infested animal corpse. Quite a smell. Yeah, I'll bet. Oof. Not a smell you there. Like to smell. Fine, you have it. I'm full. I can't eat anymore. Another herb. Chef is getting fucking full now and all. You grab it. <coughs> uh, I'll take that. You, you can have that okay. one. What the fuck are those? Mount is an HQ. I'm under attack by five DOJ 
Oh yeah, this, this is the first one where uh, someone drops an F-bomb. So, they actually died quicker. Yeah, Resi 4 is the first one where they say shit. And this is the first one where someone says fuck. That. Yeah, you're doing a swell job there, Shiva. That was sarcastic, and, and then, yeah, she up the game. Okay, fair enough. Oh, shit. Shiva, shoot, shoot the thing. It's always been the thing with Shiva. In a segment where she covers you, she covers you, but if anyone gets close to her, she's fucked. <laughs> I do love me a good SMG. Yes, regroup. If you please. Uh, what's next? He always catches me off guard, that guy. And then I just caught him off guard. Never mind. Cheers, bro. Sniper ammo? Delicious. Oh, it's this bit. I probably should have took that. Shit. So, this is the door that is locked from the other side. Now, I found this by accident when I first played the demo, and then it turned out that it is actually a speedrun tactic. You can use a grenade to get that door open, if you aim it right. And I haven't done it in fucking years, so I will give it a go. Uh, if you can pull this off on professional, it's, it makes this, this section so much fucking easier. That, that is, of course, if you get lucky and actually get the grenade you need. Because if you whiff your throw, like I am most likely going to do, you'll need more than one. Bosh! So I should have five, so that should actually be... Okay. Now I have five. That should be more than enough. I can't remember if you do it from this floor. I think it is. Oh, it should be right below me. Pray for me. No, too high. Fucking way too high. actually got it. Well, either way, I missed all of them. I had it right, so it should have actually worked, but I don't think it did. I might not have got enough bounce. Maybe if I aimed a little bit lower, it would have bounced far, right, far enough. Oh well. Not that it matters, because I do have a sniper rifle. Take it. Take it. She's got all the heals. She's gonna fucking need them in a minute. Because she is garbage. Right. Let's see if the door's open. I don't think it is, because I think the exclamation mark down there actually disappears when the lock gets broken. Yeah. Shit. Oh, fuck. I was. That's what gets me every time I throw it at the actual marker. It's to the right of it, so you actually need to go off to the f ah, fuck's sake. So I would have done it if I was actually standing in the right fucking spot. Twat. That, that takes me for not paying attention, wouldn't it? Oh well. Off you pop. Have fun. But not too much fun.
Altså... Oh, you lucky bastard. Gave him a haircut. Yeah. Okay, what do you want me to fucking do that? Just, just fucking... Screw you. Shiver, mate. Get a move on. Catch you. There's one thing I like, it's a good sniping section. Not counting that that bit from the first splint cell. Fucking hell. God. Uh, if you haven't seen that, I, uh, I suggest going and watching my my original splinter cell playthrough. Um There's a section in the game right at the end where you actually have to shoot someone. Like you have to snipe them, but it's fucking impossible because Sam Fisher just like gets the shakes big time. This was also in the demo. I think I already said that. And I think there's another weapon around here somewhere. You can get plenty of fucking treasure from here though. Which I do want because I do like shinies. Shevin needs fucking ammo. Shiver is uh, kind of boned, actually. Just as well, I will ignore her. Oh, you winker! That one actually hit them. Fuck off. Dick bags. Thank you. You grab it. Okay. Yeah, you, you, grab you can have that. Okay. I'm a merciful god. Remember that. Should have just whipped out my shotgun. Oh lord, he coming. No biggie. Uh, he doesn't actually come until I open the door. But, it's quite easy to take down if I use the sniper rifle and if I actually hit him with it. And you have to kill him to get the key. Pretty sure that'll take a lot longer than that to cut through a metal bar with a chainsaw. Do him. Honk. Uh. Fuck, I forgot about these guys. Out of the way, please. Man with chainsaw coming through. Worth it. I just killed Cheva. How? She didn't have low health, did she? Hmm. Oh well, um... Eh, yeah, I'll keep them. That do, good enough. But yeah, I do, do... Yeah, she had fucking, like, over half health. Okay. I wanna, uh, I wanna limit myself to what I can actually, like, buy. Because obviously I've got everything unlocked, so I don't want to be just grabbing them overpowered guns. Wait, did, did fancy helping you there? Sick him, or don't? Excuse me. Let's get a decent distance away then. Don't just fucking stop there, Shiver. Right. 
first shot, I just missed him. Yeah. Lucky. Ooh. I pushed my luck way too much there. Uh oh. Excuse me. Speeds are fucking rough before they're upgraded. What the fuck, Shiva? You just fucking ran into it. Daft bin. Yeah, you've got fucking full heal. Use it. Fucking managing her ammo as well. What the fuck, game? Right, uh, I don't think I've got any grenades on me. She never has, though. Sweet. Dude just will not die. Fuck me. Oh, just set myself on fire. Dude, die. There we go. Guys, if you could be quiet, please. I need to know with his fucking shotgun. Shotgun chainsaw still running or not? I think it is. Okay, that took a lot more ammo than that should have. Fuck, I just would not die. And the chainsaw's not still running, so he's not about to berserk on me. I think fuck. It sucks when they do that. Because they just keep coming. And they just keep swinging. And if they get close, you're dead. I can't believe how much fucking ammo that took. This is on normal. To be fair though, I haven't actually upgraded my shotgun at all. Or my sniper rifle. Not really much point because I get better ones later on. Soonish, I believe. <laughs> we're about to meet Josh. Take it, Roger. I think we are. You need to be careful. Yeah. Bit of herbal deodorant. Yeah, we do meet Josh. Sweet. My boy. It's a low key badass. Who you don't actually see that much of in this game. And you never see him again after this game either. Here comes a big QTE event. I just point out that there was an extremely flammable and explosive barrel filled with fuel right next to the giant tire fire. Not the best place to store it. This section is a fucker to do a pressure. He 
game over. I think it's exactly the same every time on lower difficulties, but on professional it fucking changes every time. Friendos. Sure. I don't know why it always fucking annoys me when guns make that noise in games and films. The gun will not go if you lower it. Nor does it do it when you raise it. You guys know each other. I trained under Josh. He taught me everything I know. Shiva became little sister of the team. Now Shiva, you must continue your search for Irving. According to the data we retrieved from the hard drive. We believe he has moved on to the mining area. There's more info inside. We will follow after taking care of business here. And keep your radio handy just in case. Thanks, Josh. I fucking love his accent. The African accent is just it's one of those accents I can listen to for fucking hours. Jill. It's just, it's just really calming, that is, if they're not screaming at you. <laughs> And Jamaican, even though I can't understand a single fucking word they say. <laughs> Forget it. It's just crap. Let's move out. Hey, hey. Thirty-four minutes, really? That took me thirty-four minutes. What the fuck? Ow. Saying that, no, yeah, I do only have shit guns. So, right, let's. Give that to my grenade and healing mule. Uh, can't really give her any ammo. Anyway, yeah, here's all of the guns. Not all of them, I think there's actually a few missing. Yeah, I don't have the Gatling gun or the bow in there. Uh, or the Stun rod. Seven grand, not bad. Uh, I don't know if there's any point in me upgrading the pistol anymore. Yeah, fuck it. If I find a new one, I'll just give this one the Sheva. And that is now maxed. So is the reload speed. And I'm skinned. What are we actually missing? Hang on. Hang on. Not that I need to actually buy anything. Because, I mean, I've got all the fucking trophies anyway, so. Oh, yeah, M92F, HK. Got that. The SIG, I've got. M93R, I've got that. That's actually a fucking brilliant handgun, that is. Yeah, if I've got that on me. The M3. Jailbreaker. Hydra. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah, I actually got that on me. Yeah. Yep. 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 Uh, that's it. Oh, yeah, I don't have a grenade launcher. Don't have a rocket launcher. Stun rod, Gatling gun, longbow. That's it. Ah. 
forgot about the vests, but you can't actually buy them until much later in the game. Well, except for me, because I've finished the game, but you know what I mean. I think when you're on the... Sheva, do you know where the mines are? Ship. Past the station. Not too far from here. Follow me. Question mark? Let me read the thing. Type 2 Plagas. As stated in earlier documentation on the subject, the original Las Plagas parasite was discovered in an isolated area in Europe. Upon maturation in a host, the parasite quickly replaces the host's will and self-awareness, rendering them highly susceptible to control by another. It was this aspect of Las Plagas that meant one so inclined could create obedient subjects who would obey directors without question, with obvious commercial application abilities. possibilities. Las Plagas quickly came under review by interested parties. The problem with commercialising Las Plagas was the time discrepancy between initial infection and when the hosts were rendered susceptible to control. I can't speak. The time between when Las Plagas is administered to the host as an egg and the time when it fully matures and attaches itself to the central nervous system was met with negative criticism. The maturation cycle of Las Plagas is relatively brief, but potential customers wished for more expedient results. With this in mind, research was undertaken to improve Las Plagas, the final result of this research becoming Type 2 Plagas. Type 2 Plagas differs from its predecessor in that it is administered in its matured state, like shoved in their mouth. From that point, the host can almost immediately be controlled. Type 2 is administered orally, or more specifically, it is forced into the mouth of the host. It's an indelicate method, but it's also the most effective. After oral administration, Type 2 rends the esophagus. Oh, really? And moves first to the medulla oblongata, then to the brain, the brain properly. Finally, the spinal cord. That's fucking brutal. Once it's taken hold of the central nervous system, the host can be controlled. So it literally rips a hole in your throat. Well, in your esophagus, which is your throat, basically. And, yeah. Climbs its way up your brain. Onto the spine. That's fucked up. Under a laboratory setting, we recorded complete control of a host in 10 seconds of administration of type 2. Aside from the reduced infection time, the type 2 Plagas appeared to share all of the characteristics of the original Las Plagas which made it more than suitable for commercialization. All that remains now is to accumulate field data from the Kijuju Autonomous Zone. The CAS. <laughs> Listed below are the three key experiments for evaluation of Type 2. How long is this? Fucking hell. Infection. Administer Type 2 samples to 10 previously infected individuals. Previously infected. And observe the rate at which they spread the infection. These 10 sub test subjects must be given enough Type 2 samples to create measurable results. Oh, people that have already been infected, give them samples so they can spread it. Observe to what extent the barbaric behaviour induced by the Plagas can be controlled. This will be ascertained by witnessing the results of the directive to engage the BSA operatives within the area. Accumulate data on Type 2 in combat. Type 2 hosts will battle BSA operatives deployed in the area. This experiment will be the last stage for evaluating the effectiveness of Type 2 Plagas. <sighs> so, it's kind of weird, because uh, Resident Evil usually, um, Come on, like each of the virus is its, its own trilogy. Okay. So you had the T and G virus, which is the first three games, but the G virus is only in one of them. So it's the T virus, really. Then you've got... Plagas, which is in 4, 5, and 6, but in 6 you also have the C virus, which is a different version of the T virus. It gets very confusing. <laughs> oh, that's fucking... oh, fuck off. Wow, that paid literally no attention to the shotgun. Shut up, cover me! Oh man, what the fuck, this shotgun sucks! Not 
nice of him to wait for me to reload. Reload speed on this shotgun is garbage. Oh yeah, I'll leave you with that. I should have just fucking shot the mine. <laughs> Idiot. Haha, -ha, you missed. Alright, get up here because the dogs can't fucking follow me. Shooting at motherfucker. I was expecting him to mutate actually, because he only took two shots. Fucking the amount of times I've run into that mine. Um, fuck. Uh, Alright, fine. Whoo! That was a fun little ride, wasn't it? <laughs> okay, so now we go down into the mine, I think. Yeah, terrific. Oh, just having a, a drinkage of tasty, delicious Dr. Pepper. And now my hands are wet because there's so much fucking condensation on that bottle. Christ. Alright, this bit sucks. You grab it. Roger. I'll take the lantern. Stay close to me. No you. Hey. I am the one with the guns. Alright, let's get rid of the map for now. Alright, what have I got ammo wise? Uh fuck all. Actually. Shower, I really need you to not be useless right now, because I can't see dick. Red herb? I'll take it. I used to be able to get through here without actually fucking picking the lantern up. That was many years ago. Oh goody. Just what I need. Okay, the damage on this pistol is maxed and it's garbage. Ugh. Oof. Oh he's dead. Okay. Okay, right, I'll take that. Pretty sure this gun is actually supposed to have a flashlight fitted on the underbarrel. This way, Sheva. remember enemies taking this much damage on normal. Damn. Um. That was weird. Ooh, flashbangs. Could have used them about fucking ten seconds ago. Okay, we are struggling with inventory space right now. Give Sheva the uh, sniper rifle. But uh, I want it, so. Pfft. That's what I think of that. There is treasure here, I believe. I think you actually get combinable treasures in this game. Sucks. That was, that was one thing I actually really enjoyed. 
been ready for. Thanks to that, you had to like, investigate a treasure to figure out what you can do with it. I actually let go of the buttons like as soon as he got stunned and Chris just kept stabbing. I don't know why. Oh for fuck's sake. Fucking bastards. Oi! Are you okay? I'd have been better if you didn't just fucking take all of my ammo. Take it! Roger! Dick. Bosh. The knife really does suck in this game. Which is annoying because in RE4 it's like it's one of the best fucking guns in the game. Shiva. Such a wanker. Thanks for breaking that box for me. Nerd. Yeah, you take that. I'll take that. Can't believe she fucking nicked all of the handgun ammo. Good idiot, butch. the boxes for me, how kind of him. Um, I'm lost. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I don't know where I am. Oh, here we go, found it. This is the way out. Yeah, you crank that. This section sucks. Okay, bro. That is sin next to crank. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it, she can fight him. She's got a handgun ammo. So will you, Shevet? Cranky, cranky. Here we go. So graphically, this game really has not fucking held up. Resi 4 has. This, it looks, looks like ass. Still yellow as fuck. Oh, there's loads of uh, TNT knobheads here. Oh boy. Thanks for the help, Dynamite Nerd. I guess. Thanks, bro. Where did he come from? It's raining crossbowmen. Oh, there's a fucking number one there. I guess he was shooting me. Terrific. Oh. oh, straight punch. Mine. Oh, you can just leave here, but. I fucking I need to find out. Plus, it is actually easier taking out everyone. Otherwise, they chase you through the caves. And, uh, makes it more annoying. Just got from Sassy again. Cock. Lucky. 
there's something very wrong about the amount of fucking damage these enemies are taking on normal. Oh. I wasn't paying attention to how much ammo I had. Die! Fucking hell. What the fuck, man? So much damage! They have so much health! This is... something is wrong here. Something is very wrong. Hello, they just did. Thank you. Oh, they yanked the fuck out of my neck. Dying. Get out of my way. Now, definitely get out of my way now. Fucking annoying bastard. And yeah, you know. It's just fucking. Oh, it's dynamite. Dynamite! He got fucking. Right up behind me there. I'm sure I wasn't expecting him to be there. Okay, yeah. Less looting, more more running. Aha! We are here. This is where Irving is supposed to be. I think I get a new sniper rifle which is great Thanks, full health baby yeah I'm not too bothered about getting treasures as well because that just makes the game take longer and I don't really need them Looking bastard. They're just like all the other pieces of scum terrorists. Oh, I'm not like them. I'm a businessman with standards. Oh, drop the weapon. Or how about you drop yours? There's two of us. Yeah, and she just dragged him through shards of glass well, poking out of the window frame. Which would have shredded him to ribbons. Look at this. Never underestimate how fucking sharp glass is. <laughs> I found that out the hard way. That's in the marshlands. I nearly cut my finger off of a pint glass. That was a fun Delta day, that Chris was. We located Irving, but he got away. Hello. He's heading for an oil field in the marshlands. Right, Sheva. Uh, you can have that. And I'll have that. Uh, pretty sure she just robbed that herb. No, I didn't want to take cover. Okay, I can't look in there. Oh shit, forgot about the turret. Oh, gotcha. So this is the dragon of semi-auto sniper rifle. Of course, like it always is. And this section is a bit of a bastard because they fucking keep coming. There's a lot of enemies here. 
And I can keep going on that fucking turret. Oh shit, I think one of them was actually making a break for it. And I ignored him. Oh, shotgun. Nice. Yep, someone's back on the turret. He's still alive. Damn, he took a kick in. Literally. Turret. I've lost the turret. Okay, it's beyond the box. Pop. Sorry. Lol. I forgot you can actually strafe in this game. That's something you can't do in RE4. And it's actually really fucking helpful. Especially when they throw shit at you. I heard a crossbow fly past my ear. There he is. There's a geyser in the toilet as well. Let's see. Wait, what? Did I just pick that up through the wall? <laughs> I think he actually drops a treasure. Toilets. Ugh. How do people shit in them, seriously? Without shitting all down your legs and fucking ankles and stuff. How? I genuinely want to know. Especially if I have an arse explosion, that's gonna go fucking everywhere. Uh, I've got dynamite knob heads. really awkward. It's just standing there just like, uh, I didn't throw that dynamite. So it is. Well, there's supposed to be a treasure here. Hmm. Or was it on this ledge? I can't remember. Oh no, there is. Let's throw that ladder. And then there's another one here. Oh, this is dynamite town. Give me a hand. This is gonna hurt. <laughs> Fucking called it. No, Sheva. Uh, no. Really? You really are a fucking liability sometimes, you ever. Fucking hell. What's that dude doing? He just lit his, he just lit his dynamite, walked around in a circle and then fucked off up the ladder. Don't throw it at me. Bosh. Well, it is kind of weird that they are using shovels. You don't want to get hit with the fucking sharp edge of one of them. <laughs> it fucking hurts. Oh, fuck yeah. Iframes. Uh oh. Run away. You are a bad man. 
Uh, anyway, I'm going to drop down here and grab this treasure real quick. Uh, so, excuse me. Nice. Diamond. Excuse me. Let me take this bastard out first. Like so. Uh, run away. Dynamite that, fucker. Fuck up. Snap. I believe that's actually a trophy for doing that. And I think I actually struggled for quite a while to get it. <laughs> but it's like, I think you have to do like 10 of them or something like that. What did she just aim at? Oh, he's up there. Don't waste your ammo. Let's go. Why am I full? Did I not just cane literally everything? Oh no, I've got a shitload of shotgun ammo. That'll do it. Uh, hmm. Not good. I need. Uh, I need a free inventory slot. Um. I owe you one. This thing's so fucking weird looking. They ferry it around in a lorry in a container is pretty fucking disturbing. Don't know how that guy died. Uh, a friend. <laughs> a very big fat assed bullet sponge is what it is. Okay, we want them. No, I want them back. I pushed circle to fucking exit the inventory. Right, Sheva, don't fucking pick them up like you usually do. Yeah, Sheva likes to go and pick those mines up after you place them. It's kind of funny, sometimes. Uh, get to the squishy sword! Get to the squishy! foul at shooting it. <laughs> no, I'm good. Take time, Chris. Flee! Look for more mines.
That's cheating. What? I don't think I've ever had that happen to me. Uh, he just walked over to mine and did nothing. I don't think he's ever done that to me either. Come on. There we go. Yes, if only there was some sort of explosive device that I've used on it three times already to knock it down. Dirty little cheat. Ever. Oh fuck me, really? Oh, that is the most Sheva thing to have happened ever. Oh my god. I hate her so much. <laughs> She's so fucking useless. Mong. At least she has grenades on her. Can't remember they're there. Fuck you, Sheva. Useless. Useless. You grab it. Roger. Okay, all right, let's get fully loaded first. Okay, we are loaded. Uh... I owe you one. Thanks. All right, now we get the mines. So yeah, what we'll stock up on them first. So I think I can carry five. It'll save me. I'm having to stop and look for more. Coming in pretty by it. Daka 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 daka. I don't even know if I'm actually going to be able to kill it because the weapons I have suck. Um, I was going to say, cheater. Flee. No, don't do that, because I'll probably die, or you'll die. You can actually use the knife against this in PC. Because it's like based on FPS of the game plus like actually being in contact with it. Because it's got a long hitbox, so the knife actually does a lot of damage to it. This might hurt. Kill it. That usually helps. Like so. Taken at least fucking like 80 handgun shots.
Hehe, <laughs> now we gotta go on a road trip with my boy. Wait, you're not Josh. This bit can be fucking rough. It's very uh, RNG based, this bit. But we're not gonna do it yet, we're gonna save that for the, in the next part. Got an A rank again. Ugh. Give me S's. 83.7% accuracy. Oh, I died. And I took a while. Oh well. Blah. Don't know how it's given me such low ranks for time. Because that's basically how quick you'd do it. Actually, it'd take longer than that if it was on your first time. Oh well. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you're enjoying. Uh, yeah, there's a lot more Resident Evil to come. Um, I'm not even halfway through this game yet. Nowhere near. There's seven chapters, I think. Each with like four or five episodes, and that was chapter two, episode two. So yeah, it's quite a bit to go. And yeah, the game's going to start getting more interesting from now on. So yeah, this is going to be fun. I love this game. So thank you so much for watching. I really hope you're enjoying. If you're enjoying, feel free to subscribe to the channel. And hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Mind how you go.